What's up Ginger Cornets? Pokemon Journeys Episode 30. This episode had been receiving flack pretty much ever since the plot synopsis came out, and I can totally see why. Something about Pikachu running away due to jealousy of Riolu sounded pretty out of character. It also didn't help that that's two episodes in a row about jealous electric types. After I watched this episode, I headed straight to Twitter just to see what people thought. And my god, I don't think there's ever been a more divisive reception to a Pokemon episode. Like, ever. A lot of people love it, but at the same time, I've heard several people say that this was the worst episode of the series. But personally, I found the episode... not great. In fact, I'd say it's actually... fantastic. This has become one of my favorite episodes of not just Journeys, but Pokemon as a whole. And with such a divisive reception, I figured I would share my reasons as to why. And I'm gonna keep this discussion light on spoilers for anyone who hasn't seen the episode yet. Also, these words are coming from someone who really enjoyed that ho -Oh episode that everyone else hated, plus I have an anime profile pick, so my opinions literally do not matter in the slightest. But with that said, this episode was beautiful. Now to start off, was Ash focusing a little too much on Riolu's training, kind of ignoring Pikachu for the whole day? Yeah, pretty much. And while Pikachu did seem bothered by this, Delia was able to comfort him, even mentioning how special he is to Ash. But with Ash's stubborn fixation on training Riolu, along with Delia leaving, it honestly makes sense for Pikachu to try and follow her back to Pallet Town. I don't really see this as out of character. Pikachu had every right to take a break from Ash. But then there's the question of whether or not this was out of character for Ash. And to be honest, I really don't think it was. Keep in mind, this is a kid who's always fixated on training and making his Pokémon stronger. And this is really the first time, at least to my knowledge, that this mentality ended up hurting someone else. Now if Ash were to start screaming at Pikachu out of anger, that would be out of character. But as it stands, I feel Ash just made a mistake. I mean, we all make mistakes, it's part of growing up. But the important part is owning up to those mistakes and learning from them. I also like that Koharu was the one who knew exactly what was going on, as she had just gone through something very similar with Yamper. I'd also get into how great Pikachu's journey with Mr. Mime was, but that's getting into some spoilers. I will say though, I love how much expression was said without any words. Also Oshawott in a car. 10 out of 10. But yeah, let me know your thoughts on this divisive piece of media. I know this video was short, I just wanted to give my opinions on it since everyone's talking about it online. Longer videos are coming in the future, I promise. So yeah, have a lovely day.